of them are bad, some of them are encouraging, and some of the, uh, the experiences are discouraging. But you know, that is life. Okay? Remember, when Jesus Christ uh, trained and equipped the disciples, the disciples, of course, have many uh, um, ideals and they have many um, you know, uh, expectations. But Jesus Christ equipped them. Jesus Christ was with them uh, in their moments of uh, joy, moments of uh, sorrows, in their moments of actually seemingly failure, but actually those moments are learning moments. Okay. Sometimes uh, uh, the real work is not actually it's if you have not encountered any problem in a certain area of ministry, uh, that's uh, beyond normal because normally you'll face many challenges and that what ministry is all about. But of course, uh, although there are many challenges, discouragements, God still uh, is victorious. Amen? Amen? So let's give Him the glory. And I hope that you'll not get tired uh, as students in uh, joining this kind of ministry. Okay? Not only here in the Voice of Youth, join in other ministries as well. And I'd like to thank uh, the presence of uh, Dan Rev, uh, our AYM uh, uh, head, so, and also the other officers uh, for uh, supporting the Voice of Youth. And then we'll, we'll all support uh, the ministries of this university is working together. As I have said this morning, okay, let, don't allow your career to hinder you to join God's mission. Because uh, the mission in your career should not be separated. It should go hand in hand, like your hands, like your eyes, like your feet. Okay? So I hope you'll continue to serve God. We are here. We are here. We are all here because uh, we love God and God motivates us to do so. And also let's uh, uh, support the, the Master Guide who will be having the promotion next week uh, through Lyser and all the rest. Okay? And I'd like to thank the, the officers of uh, Voice of Youth. Although the uh, uh, other officers are not here, they are out already and uh, Howard is in Philippine, Philippine. Okay, resting. I don't know if he is uh, stressed out. <laughs> <laughs> but he told us that uh, because of swimming, because of his class in swimming, I don't know what happened. He got on the big class. <laughs> okay, but that guy is small but terrible. Okay. <laughs> Okay. I told him to rest, but he is still you know, like no. okay. So we'll give him the time to speak, please. Okay. So, uh, Howard, can you give the short the key remark? Okay. Uh, we'll be praying for him. He is our president, and I have seen his commitment. Okay. Let's our next election would be next year, okay? So, Howard. Howard, uh, okay. Howard, <laughs>
ating gumula sa kanya. At hanggang ngayon, pinagbubulay-bulayan ko pa rin kung talagang pero nung <laughs> una po ay talagang nung 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 pinipiro ko nila kay Ronel na kasi magiging nung nung masabi niya sa kaya mag-resign siya at sabi niya ako tayo magiging sunod pero hindi ko alam tapos nung day before nung meeting namin parang parang bigat na bigat ako parang hindi ko may imagine kung magiging totoo yung yung sinabi ni kay Ronel and I pray for it na lang kasi Medyo mabigat yung, mabigat yung pointer pa ako sa, sa MA. And sabi ko, kung talagang kalawaban ng Panginoon ay pwede naman akong tanggapin. At naging inspiration ko yung napasa ko sa sinulat ni Mark Finley na lahat ng binibigay ng, na trabaho ng Panginoon ay binibigay niya ng sapat na kapangyar, kapangyarihan para magawa ng, natin ng bagay pen. Tama po ay tayo magtulong-tulong na parayang pang mga kapatahan ang may involve sa boys of youth upang sila rin ay maranasan nila yung pagpapagong pagpapagong naranasan natin sa nakapangyarihan ng Banal na Espiritu. May pagpalayang pa tayo. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, thank you, uh, Mark. And let's continue to pray for this uh, child. Again, to Ren, let's pray for this, okay? Uh, this will be his story. Okay, the story of God in your life as you join in the voice of it. So, we want to have 365 life changing stories of voice of it. Please write yours, okay? Write yours. So, we have already, like, uh, um, first time. And the other one, uh, I forgot the, the title. So uh, make your story interesting. So that, don't just focus on, uh, you know, focus on how God worked okay, through you during the voice. Okay. And please submit, uh, write your story as up so that we can. Anytime you can uh, give it to any of the officers. Can you please stand all the officers of the voice of the people? Okay, so so that you can share with them the uh, stories. And also I'd like to thank uh, Hazel for, you know, uh, she's really gifted in you know, art and also in designing. So she is the artist and also She'll be designing the Voice of Youth Manual, okay, uh, yeah, okay. cover, cover, and I hope we'll be able to launch it on October, okay, because we'll be, we're waiting for this. It's in the URC already, but we're waiting for this, and I hope uh, we have enough because we want more, but I think we have, uh, I think we have already 80 plus this one. I don't know how many, so that we can uh, also. Uh, finish that one. So our project for the poison of is this one and the poison of And also uh, we'll be uh, having, do you want to promote the, the <coughs> So good afternoon again everyone. Uh, afternoon night. Uh, this coming week we will be having our what we call the youth week. Uh, it's been done previously, but uh, this time we will do it again. During those weeks, just like what Pastor uh, mentioned a while ago, all the ministries, not only small group, but also singing group and the voice of youth, Pastor Guy will be, uh, we will be uh, making a booth in the College of Medicine building wherein every group will uh, uh, show their ministries, the ministries they are doing, and every Afternoon, there will be I think one choir who will sing around 5:30 to 6. Pastor, 
So if you want to uh, hear their uh, music, their songs, every 5, 30, I think, up to 6, they will, uh, uh, one choir will sit in the, the area where we will be having our booth. And we will also be having a special program during midweek, the dedication of all the officers of different ministries, religious organizations, small group, singing group, at Pedro Pasok, kung gusto niyo po sumama yung officer ng words video. Lahat ng officer, kasama na natin. And we will also have a promotion for Master Guide during the best run. And the Sabbath program will be also be handled by the Administration Ministry up to afternoon. Actually, what we want in this program is very simple, that many students will really be involved in the ministry. In the past years, uh, we have been trying to uh, promote this uh, different kind of music. And this time, we really want to make uh, a more intentional, more, what do you call that, a more intense. We want really to make, uh, be, uh, that, that more and more students will participate in this kind of ministry. So we are inviting everyone, if you have your groups already, you can uh, please help us and help your group in, in inviting more people to join in your ministries. And I'm sure that if more people will uh, be involved in this ministry, more people will also be blessed. And this is one thing that I am always telling those uh, people who are in the ministry. It's just like this. Do you want that you are, uh, it's, you, it, do you want that you are eating a very delicious food? And you, you are just seeing your sisters or brothers just uh, watching you eating those delicious food. Of course, we do not want that. We want to share the food that we are eating. We want them to experience the joy of being in the ministry. We want them to, to, to experience the blessing that we experienced when we were there in that ministry. So I'm encouraging everyone to please invite more people to participate in this ministry so that they can also experience the blessing of being part of these different ministries. So please support our program and actually the theme of our program is, is it's more fun in the ministry. So we must really show to other people, to other students that it is really more fun to be in this ministry. So uh, again, I encourage everyone to participate in this program. So again, good afternoon. And so we have this uh, eight people who have uh, signified their intention to join the worship group. We'll be praying for them. Okay. After the closing prayer, we'll have. Uh, can we? Uh, can we pray here in front? So we'll have a uh, circle, and also the time to pray for these people who would like to join the worship group. And also, let's pray for the youth week. Also, uh, we'll continue to uh, give and put some of this uh, promotion, promotional materials for first. Okay, what else do you have still concerns? Let's also pray for the, the upcoming Voice of Youth Camp. That would be like, like we want. Uh, um, that is designed for the oldest student uh, supposed to be, but uh, will include okay, all interest. And if you are interested also to uh, have the Andrews Bible, okay, it is discounted twenty dollars only, or more or less in nine hundred pesos. Okay, so uh, supposed to be it's one thousand three hundred. Yeah, twenty dollars. It's supposed to be thirty dollars, but because of the you know, Kuya Bing, they sponsored. So I want uh, you to have the Andrews Bible if you want. Uh, we walk up. We are uh, you know aiming for actually one hundred to two hundred uh, orders. Yeah. I hope you get uh, that Bible. That Bible is very beautiful because. Especially in Daniel Revelation and other, those texts with 
you know, there are texts in the Bible that have questions, that you have questions. They have, you know, important comments uh, regarding it. Yeah, so we'll, uh, during the forum, we'll also, uh, uh, I'll, I need to look for the list for those who have already signed. Because he wanted to uh, give it and deliver it on Monday. So next week, it, uh, the, uh, the Bible will be here, but I don't want uh, to get those Bibles without orders. It's a lot of money. <laughs> but it is, it's good investment, especially for the pastor. Uh, because our, the, the theologies uh, will be having uh, their what, uh, forum on Friday. So during the time, Every pastor should have this. Okay. So let's sing the closing song if you don't have it. So before we sing our closing song, I would like to specially thank Dr. Si Pastor Ron. The ministry na, de ba? Since he has been sent here by God. Meron tayong program na ganito. Can we, can I hear you say, thank you, Pastor Ron. We love you with the love of the Lord. One, two, three, go. Thank you, Pastor Ron. We love you with the love of the Lord. Thank you so much, Pastor. Alam nyo po, nagkakasap kami ni Pastor Ron. Hindi ko yadal, sabi ko, tinanggan mo yung office sa ano, EYM. Tapos wala na ang office sa MA. Kasi busy, busy na din po sa city. Pero hindi ko pinitawan yung BOY. Kasi ano, yung leadership din ni Pastor Ron and praise God kasi nag-enjoy talaga ako dito sa BOY. So, saan yung mga first year? Ay, malis na ako. Malis na yung mga in-invite kong first year. Gusto ko sana silang pasalamatan kasi nga iba din yung impact kapag yung... Ayan. Si Rem. Si Rem. Si Saira. Ay, ay, ay. Hindi kasi may in-invite ako eh. Lima ata sila na freshman. Tapos ano, sabi ko. Kasi pag freshman, wala po masyadong ginagawa. Ang hirap kasi mag-invite kapag medyo graduating na. Ang hirap nilang ano eh. Sabi, busy na sila, ganyan. Eh pag kapag na-addict na sila since first year, hindi mahirap na tumangin. So let us all stand and sing, Make me a servant. Or our closing song. Make me a servant. Sing. Make me a servant. Come forth all at me. Lord, let me lift up those who are weak. And may the prayer of my heart always be.